Two questions, please. <laughs> of course. America is back was your motto at the first NATO summit last year. And you've come to this summit here and the one in Germany after the U.S. Supreme Court overturned constitutional protections for abortion, after the shootings in Buffalo and Texas, at a time of record inflation, and as new polling this week shows that 85% of the U.S. public thinks the country is going in the wrong direction. How do you explain this to those people who feel the country is going in the wrong direction, including some of the leaders you've been meeting with this week, who think that when you put all of this together, it amounts to an America that is going backward? They do not think that. You haven't found one person, one world leader to say America is going backward. America is better positioned to lead the world than we ever have been. We have the strongest economy in the world. Our inflation rates are lower than other nations in the world. The one thing that has been destabilizing is the outrageous behavior of the Supreme Court of the United States on overruling not only Roe v. Wade, but essentially challenging the right to privacy. We've been a leader in the world in terms of personal rights and privacy rights. And it is a mistake, in my view, for the Supreme Court to do what it did. But I have not seen anyone come up to me do anything other than, nor have you heard them say anything other than, thank you for America's leadership. You've changed the dynamic of NATO and the G7. So I, uh, I can understand why the American people are frustrated because of what the Supreme Court did. I can understand why the American people are frustrated because of inflation. But inflation is higher in almost every other country. Prices of the pump are higher in almost every other country. We're better positioned to deal with this than anyone, but we have a way to go. And the Supreme Court, we have to change that decision by codifying Roe v. Wade. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Kilmeade. I want you to do me a favor. I want you to click to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page. This is the only way that I know for sure that you're not going to miss any great commentary, any great news bites, any great interviews coming your way on Fox. You can get it all here on YouTube. So subscribe right now.